Hello everyone, welcome to this course which is Excel Fundamentals Quick Start Guide. So welcome once again to our course Excel Fundamentals Quick Start Guide. My name is Charles and I will be walking you through this course and we are going to be, we will be working together with you on the materials that are within this course. If you want to be an efficient finance professional, you need to be great at using Microsoft Excel. You could be working in the areas of, let's say, investment banking. You could be working in, in areas of equity research, in areas of financial planning and analysis, maybe working in areas of corporate development, areas of wealth management or risky management. So regardless of the specific role, you will find that most finance professionals spend a good portion of their day working in Excel. And that's why a strong Excel skills are so critical for any job involving financial analysis or financial modeling. So this course, which is the Excel fundamentals, in other words, it's our quick start guide. It's for beginners and even those professionals, they can actually go through this course so that they can be able to understand some of the few things that we need to, we need to handle, especially those that are working in finance departments. So this course is designed to start from the first principles with the basics of Excel. We will start by describing the advantages of using the keyboard to operate your computer. And we are we will go over some of the most common keyboard shortcuts that can help you improve your efficiency as a finance professional. We 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 we, we are also going to take you through the main parts of the Excel interface and I will show you exactly what they, they are used for. In other words, when we look at some of the parts of Excel interface or some of the things that are within the Excel interface, we need to know if I want to do ABCD, where should I go on that Excel interface? So I will let you know which one is doing this and which one is doing that depending on which activity you want to cut out. So having looked at the main Excel interface, the main parts of the Excel interface, then we'll move on to the Excel settings and I will show you the settings that we recommend here at KC Accountancy Education Center. So we shall be able to see some of the settings that we need to actually do when we are using our Microsoft Excel. So we are also going to show you where to find and set up the quick access toolbar in Excel and how you can use that to further increase your speed with the keyboard. Because one of the things that we are focusing on is to make sure that we use more of the keyboard than using the mouse. So if you are not using the mouse, then what are the things that we need actually to know? Because when you are going to be focusing on the, on the keyboard, it will help us increase the speed when we are using to this. So by doing so, we need to set, we need to have our quick access toolbar set up in the right way so that we can be able to save time. That's the second thing that we that we are going to focus on. Then finally, we are also going to show you some of the most common features of these softwares that get used by finance professionals around the world. So this course is designed to be very interactive. We have provided an Excel template. We can look at our Excel template before we go, before we go on 
can have a look at our Excel template. And this is, if I minimize this a bit, let me try to look at the Excel file that we are talking about, the one we are going to, 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 to have a look at. It's the one we've provided. This is the Excel file that we are talking about that are provided in our Telegram channel where we can download and be able to see some of these things that we are going to be looking at. So we've provided the, the Excel template that you can download from our Telegram channel. When you download that Excel file, it's going to allow you to be able to have a live discussion whereby you are going to be interacting. In other words, we are going to be taking you through the things that we are going to be discussing and you will be able to also sort out some of the things yourself because you'll be having the template that we are going to be using in this Excel fundamental, in this Excel course. So that's the, that's the one that we are talking about. Then we can also look at the, we, we are also going to provide what we call the we we are also going to provide what we call the the we are going to provide with you the summary sheet in other words this summary this summary sheet is going to be bringing the the the, the shortcuts that we are going to be mainly focusing on we can maybe try to 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 have a look at that we can have uh, have a look at that some other time but we are going to also provide that it's going to be within our it's going to be provided within our telegram channel where you can download and be able to have a look at some of the shortcuts and what they actually do in excel so you also find that some of these some of these shortcuts we are going to be you can actually use them after you have finished the course and you can use them as you're doing your practice. In other words, they can be helping you to guide you through some of the things that you can actually do to set up your Excel files correctly. So, so as we take you through this course, we want also to be engaging yourself, to be doing some of the things that we are going to be handling within this, this tutorial. So, having seen the documents that we are going to be using we need also to look at the to 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 look at the other ideas that we are going to be discussing with you so when you are walking through when you are when, when you are taking you through this small exercise exercise that we that we are going to be doing we want also to be engaging yourself you see what we do and you can actually do it yourself so that you can actually pick the practical aspect of excel and that's why we are providing these excel templates and we are providing the summary sheets for you to be able to download you download that those two documents you will pick them from our telegram channel it is the link is there in the in in in, in the about section of our youtube channel you can go there join our telegram channel and be able to have some of the things with you so that you can actually be able to follow up in the right in the right way so when you are walking you through the ex this the the exercises that we are going to be having that we've prepared in this course this will help you improve your knowledge they will help you improve your confidence and they will also help you to improve your proficiency with the Microsoft. So this is this will really help you prepare for some of the work that you are going to be encountering in your finance career. Remember our main focus is to handle the professional, the accounting and finance professional. So we are looking at providing all the needed information for someone to actually get to know certain things and how they are done as long as that person is within the background of finance and accounting so we have a ton of exciting materials 
that we have packed within this course. So let's dive in and get started to see where we can actually see. So in the next video, we are going to be looking at the learning outcomes. We see what are the things that we expect to learn from this course. So that's what we are going to see in the next video. See you there.